On August 23rd, 12 Hong Kongers with political charges in Hong Kong were arrested by Chinese coast guards. They have now been detained in China for two months with charges of participating and organizing illegal border crossing. The Hong Kong government had known about the operation all along. That day, government flying servants sent a fixed wing aircraft to where the 12 were disappeared. The internal red call indicate that the mission was indeed police operation. Lawyers appointed by the families were told that the detainees had appointed other lawyers to follow the case. They were threatened to pull out of the case and deny all media interviews, otherwise their careers would be in jeopardy. We are not allowed to deliver any life critical medications to some of them who have severe depression, asthma, and skin issues. We have no information about their status since they left home. We're extremely concerned about their safety, as the CCP is infamous for torturing and silencing human rights activists. The Hong Kong administration has prioritized the agenda of the Chinese government over the well-being of its own citizens. Worrying evidence suggests that they have colluded with the Chinese authorities to stage a de facto extradition of their own people to mainland China. Today, it is the 12 Hong Kong activists. Tomorrow can be any one of us around the world. The international community has to start on the right side of truth and hold China accountable for its human rights assaults. It is never too late to make it right. We stand with the Hong Kong 12. Save the 12. Save the 12. Save the 12. Save, Save the 12 Hong Kong youths and bring them home. They are waiting for us. Bring them home. Save the 12 Hong Kong youths.